playing Pet Simulator X for the last time. For two years, I've played this game and have done quite a lot of crazy things, and from giving away 1.4 million Robux worth of pets to becoming one of the literal best players in the world. And with the release of Pet Simulator 99 just around the corner, today we're going to be tying up some loose ends and closing this chapter to get ready for the next. The first thing I'm going to do is introduce you to the last browser you'll ever need, Opera GX. You wouldn't want your Roblox avatar to look like this, would you? So then why does your browser have to? With Opera GX! you can unlock the true power of gamer. Not only is this browser not as memory intense as some of the other browsers, but the customization options are endless. With the new GX mod feature, you can do weird things like play a fart sound every time you type or really embrace your gamer by turning your whole browser into an arcade with the click of a button. There are endless customization options that you can add from the GX store. And my favorite is the new blocks to buy. With the single click of this button, my entire browser transforms to a new theme complete with a background, new color scheme, sound effects from typing and opening and closing browsers, and if I so choose, background music. Yo, this is chill, okay. With Opera GX, you can easily turn off and on things too from the sidebar. On top of the customization, Opera GX can totally help you with your homework. So now you can finish early and get back to gaming. Stumped on a problem? Just use Opera GX's AI feature and get AI to assist you with your homework problems. Whether it's summarizing entire articles, finding related content to a research paper, or doing math problems, AI is there to help. All I had to do was go over to the sidebar and ask AI to answer one of my daughter's homework problem last night, and it help me answer the in question and it made me look like a genius take it from me a guy who's been in the it industry for over 10 years and an avid gamer myself your browser is holding you back and opera gx is the ticket to leveling up download it here link is in the description and pinned comments import your bookmarks passwords and all your other settings with the quick import tool best of all it's totally free no cash or robux are needed all right back to the video. All right, so seriously, the first thing I'm gonna do is go through my VIP servers and stop paying for all of them. It's crazy to me that one point I was paying for 12 different VIP servers, 10 of which I gave to my Discord server to use VIP servers whenever they wanted to. And then as the game died, I uh, slowly stopped paying for a whole bunch of them to the point that now finally we only have my sub server left and my private server left, both of which we're gonna stop stop paying for. And now that that's done, let's move it on to the second item on the list today, and that's going through my mailbox and claiming all of these pets and getting rid of a whole bunch of these pets, getting the diamonds, doing the signatures. Yeah, this part's gonna take a minute. And so I don't cause any confusion, I'm actually gonna go ahead and put some of these pets in the bank, including this one right here, which uh, actually kinda happened because I went to go and transfer that pet, and then I got the whole notification that I can't actually transfer anymore because I've have too many actually done already. And when I did that and then came back, now with this one, it's <laughs> having three question marks has like its own value, which is really weird. Now, this is the first huge pet I've ever seen that actually has a value on it instead of the question marks. I actually don't even have the enchant on it anymore. It doesn't even have the best friend enchant. Where did it go? Does that mean it counts as a regular pet? No, it doesn't. What the heck, bro? Anyway, it's glitched. It is what it is. Maybe we'll have fun with it a little bit later, but for now, I'm going to drop all these pets in my bank. We're going to go ahead and start claiming some of these. And just like that, we have done it. We have completely cleared out every single gift. I've signed a whole bunch. I've gotten over 1.7 trillion diamonds from that. And for the last time, I will turn off my mailbox. We'll turn it back on in the new game when it releases. <laughs> but there we go. We have done it. Now on to the next item on the agenda. And that is to go over to the trading plaza and finally fill out the rest of the index that we can do. 
you. It is sad that there was a bunch of these pets that were supposed to come in the old game and then never did. And now, because pet code redemption will be turned off on Petsimex December 1st, a lot of these huge pets aren't actually even going to ever exist in this game. They may exist in the new game, but as far as filling out the max index in this one, if they aren't widely available yet, they will not ever be. So no Titanic Shadow Griffin, no huge white tiger, no huge fox, no huge cow, no huge doodle snow owl, or the pixel loaf, or the cyber cat, or the otter, or the scary corgi, or the huge balloon monkey, or the huge dove, or the angel cat, including all of these. Now there might actually be a couple of huge angel cats out there in the world since 15 exists, and there's definitely all of these right here. So that's exactly what I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna look, go look for all these and look for an angel cat. Transferred or not, as long as I get them in my possession, I will actually be able to get them checked off in the index. And since I have 1.7 trillion diamonds, should be able to find them. We'll go ahead and take out our other gems that we have, and let's go on a search. There's a stealth cat for 6 billion. It has been transferred, but I will buy it. There we go. Looks like we still need a stealth dragon and three different exquisite pets. All right, good. Stealth dragon, three billion gems. I'll take it. Man, these are so cheap. <laughs> Why can't all of them be this cheap? All right, let's go looking for the exquisite. We need these three exquisite pets. 15 billion. I'll take it. Come on, give it to me. What the heck? Exquisite elephant. Again, 15 billion. And the final exquisite pet we need is the exquisite cat, which put me in a weird spot. Why didn't it? What the heck, dude? Why? Where are they? I do see that there's an exquisite parrot that has not been transferred going for a hundred billion. Yeah, I think I'm glad I got it for 15. <laughs> transferred or not, man, that ain't worth it. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. There's no exquisite cats. Are you kidding me? How are there 4,000 in existence and not one of them for sale? All right, we're gonna have to check check that a little bit later, but I think the last one that I gotta look for is the huge angel cat. The rest of these aren't anywhere even close to being released yet. See so if I can type in angel. There's the huge angel cat, and I doubt they're gonna... Oh my god. <laughs> There's only 15. Do not. No way, man. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. It's, oh, it's already transferred, and it's that much. That's not worth it at all. There's only 15, though, and it's already been transfer. That really sucks, dude. I need it to finish my index, but I don't even want to finish it. Bro, I'm gonna have to think about that. No, I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna, I'm not, I'm leaving. I'm out. I'm not sticking around for this. I'm not. I don't trust myself. I am all the way up to 2173. If I could have gotten those two pets, I would have been 2175, which is basically the highest you could possibly be in this game. We're so close yet so far. Maybe we'll just circle back and do something at the end of the video. So for now, let's go ahead and move on. Now I gotta pick up my pets from the daycare. If I have any, I don't. Okay, that's good. I'm not gonna put any more in. Now, as far as like the completionist in me, I could go through and make sure I have all the achievements done, but like it's essentially just gonna keep going forever and ever and ever. And all the rest of them, man, we've done so many. It's not even funny. The only one I have not done to this point right here that doesn't just keep stacking on top of itself is this total control achievement, which which you get for upgrading your bank to a tier eight. Now, if you're a smart cookie and you actually are very observant, you probably already noticed that when I go to my bank, it is a tier eight bank. In fact, I have one tier eight bank, two tier eight banks, three tier eight banks. The problem is I bought the tier eight bank, like literally the update that it came out and this achievement didn't come out until a day after I upgraded my bank and it wasn't retro reactive. So uh, yeah, I bought the tier eight bank and I can't undo it to read do it to get the achievement. Point is, pretty much all the achievements that I can do and complete, I have done, and there's no need to do any more on those. Now, we could go crazy and start making sure we do all the quests. There was one time in my life where I thought, man, doing all the quests would be an awesome video. And then I found out really quickly that some of these quests are just downright dumb, like breaking 628 volts in the mine. There's this one right here, but uh, I've got 23 Titanics on it, and it's not breaking. You guys are weak without other pets. Let's get out the toilet cap. And they finished. Now I have 619 vaults to mine. But seeing as like they take forever to spawn in and you're kind of just sitting here waiting. Ain't nobody got time with that. But I did do pretty good on this first world. I got every other single one done minus the vault one and minus the one back here in the back which was buying 193 pets from the mysterious
mysterious merchant but like tell me this when's the last time you bought anything from the mysterious merchant or seen him for that matter <laughs> i haven't seen him in months man i know he does still pop up but i just never play this game right when he's here so yeah i think i'm good the only thing you can really buy over and over again is the west egg i could also buy the boost pack but when we go take a look at the boost packs bro i think i'm good i don't need any more and everything else i've already bought and is sold out i could buy some gems but why would i waste time doing that when if i really wanted to i could buy 50 billion gems for a lot of robux that also isn't worth it so i think i'm also good there i've unlocked every hoverboard and i've unlocked every single booth so literally the only thing i have left is to try to get two pets that are almost impossible to get or so i thought here's the exquisite cat for 20 billion that one's done 2174 only thing i'm missing is that 4.5 trillion angel cat and the only thing i know to do to get that is to like go through and start selling my titanics I don't even know how much these things are even worth considering they're all been transferred. But we'll do this one. We'll list it for two trillion. Will anybody buy it? That's the question. Somebody did. It was release the Quacken. All right, let's see if I can find that angel server again. Can we get it? Please still be there. Please still be there. It is. It's there. Oh my God. And it's, it's, it's done. It wasn't worth it. That was the worst decision ever. Would have bought that. Oh my God. I can't believe it. I just did it. I have finished it. It is done. It is so, why can't I move? I can't see what I'm doing. There it is. 21.75. And here it is. Is the huge angel cat. I'm gonna transfer it to Nick. He said, whoa, don't ask me how I got it. 2175. There it is. 21. What? He said 2176. Oh, I forgot. We went through this like two months ago and it never made it into a video, but like he went through all my inventory. I went through all my inventory and we couldn't figure out. I think he has glitched and he got something in his index that wasn't supposed to be indexable. And so 2175 is what I have. 2176 is what he has. That's it. That's it. There you go. Titanics will be indexable since you'll receive it later. So that's that's it, man. We completed the decks. He says, I'm still higher. I win till next game. I'll find out in about a few days. So the only thing left is the matter of the banks. As I said before, I've got three tier eight banks. The third one here was just supposed to house my exclusive eggs and exclusive pets and sort of became my dumping ground for a bunch of pets I didn't necessarily want to delete, but at the same time, I didn't want to keep. Let's face it, most of these are completely obsolete, including the banana right here, which used to be worth about two trillion, but but as you can see, it's gone down quite a bit considering the fact that it's not transferable to the new game. And now you're just stuck with the little banana in this one. So I'll sign it and maybe I'll give it away. But for the rest of these pets, yeah, I'm not gonna delete them, but I'm definitely just gonna leave the bank. And now they're gone forever. I don't remember the password to that account. It's gone, bro. It's totally gone. All right, so basically now I have three banks here. One's Nyx that doesn't really matter. One is this one right here that has 520 huge pets that have all been transferred. And then we have this bank right here that has 803 huge pets that have not been transferred. And well, if you look over here, I have had so many people send me invites over the years, and I think it might be time to really give back to the community. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just slowly and surely accept some invites. slowly but surely get rid of every single one of these pets that I don't actually care to own anymore. Each one of these is going to get two pets each from me. Okay, this thing has been processing forever. You have until uh, this stops processing to hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button if you're new. And uh, yo, that uh, 800 pets I have in my main bank, maybe, just maybe, you might find yourself with one of them. Oh, it's working great now. It's working great now. We can make quick work out of this. And with that, we have done it. All invites have gotten two huge pets. There is one more that I was going to do, and it's this one right here. This is the first one I have seen that just has a bunch of eggs in it. Boy, oh boy, how I want to go ahead and hatch one of these eggs. I think I'm going to. I'm going to take one of these sailor eggs and one of these tiki eggs, and I will instead give him two huge pets. Now, 
here's the thing. If I don't hatch a huge pet from these eggs right here, I will also give him the other three huges. Oh God, I hope he doesn't get mad at me. I hope he doesn't get mad at me. Especially since I had that. And then this one. Okay, come on, man. I really need a huge. Give me a huge. Okay. Where did it go? I'll give him his three. So there we go. I've given away 105 huge pets. Let's go ahead and get rid of all these transferred pets because I'm honestly not going to need them again. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to sign every single one of them and then go sell them in the trading plaza. See exactly how many gems I could get. How much How much is everybody else selling theirs for? You're selling that for $265 billion. You're selling that for $75 billion. All these people are selling it for so expensive. All right, I got 11 shiny pets for 75 billion but i'm gonna let these sell though because there's a lot of them we'll throw this one on there for 75 billion as well even though it's worth way more <laughs> While we're at it, why don't we go ahead and sell one of these Titanics? How much does it actually go for when they are auctioned and they're transferred? Four trillion. Somebody just went four trillion. Bro, no way. Why? I wouldn't pay four trillion for it, but I guess if you're staying in the game, it makes sense to do so. All right, let's try a new server. These are all rainbows and shinies again. Let's sell them for 50 billion. There you go. And then again, we'll sell this one right here for one gym and see how well it does. Yo, y'all all bought my stuff already? Jeez, calm down. So here's how we're gonna do this. We're gonna put the rest of these for sale. We're gonna list these shiny ones for 75 billion. Then we're gonna list these for 50 billion. I'm gonna go drop my gems in the bank. I've cleaned out my booth again and I have no more pets to add. I'm auctioning off a Titanic and here it goes for one gem. 385, 500, 1 trillion, 5 trillion. I was not expecting this. This is a Titanic. Oh my God, it's at six. 6. 6.9. Yo, that's a <laughs> sussy number. The fact that this is going for 7 trillion when just five months ago, it went for 7 trillion when there was nothing else in the game. Like the economy hadn't blown up yet. It hadn't died. These things were regularly going for 7 trillion. And now I get to keep the Titanic in the new game and give it away here for 6.9 trillion. That was insane. All right, one more server. We see if we can get rid of the 50 that we have here. We'll list these for 60 billion. Nobody. Uh, I feel like I was spoiled the last server. <laughs> somebody bought it. I might have to go to a new server. Bro, somebody over here has my stuff. Look at that. My Glebo that was transferred. I literally just sold this for like 75 billion diamonds and he's wanting 5 trillion for it just because I'm the one that redeemed it. All right, here's another massive server that maybe we will have some luck in. I'm gonna say hello to the chat and maybe that'll get people really interested in trying to get some things for me. What if I also equip all of my Titanics? All right, it's time to list one more Titanic here. Maybe we'll do the only other one that I have a multiple of. This one right here. We'll sell it for one gem. 41 billion. Okay, come on now. Come on. Somebody needs to. Okay, this is ridiculous, dude. Bro, this is bad. The fact that every single one of these people are trying to get it for super cheap. All the other. There we go. Finally, somebody offered a trillion. Put me out of my misery. We're going to be here for literally a year. Well, this one actually landed on a person finally, and it got all the way up to four trillion. Definitely not bad. But nobody's bought any of my stuff still. I think we'll end it here. I'll start a diamond party. Head on over to the bank with the last little gems that we got. We'll drop them in. And just selling about 200 transferred pets. I am now back up to 18 trillion gems. Maybe we can use that to buy another Titanic. So this person wants eight point eight trillion for a titanic that's already been transferred this person wants nine trillion for a titanic that's already been transferred okay yeah i'm definitely not gonna be able to find anything that's not been transferred yet i still have a lot of transferred pets i could sell as well as a lot of untransferred pets that i could sell if i wanted to but for now a couple of videos ago i owed my friend three trillion gems so that's exactly what i did i paid him back i owe nobody anything so that's it i have done pretty much everything i have set out to do in pet simulator x I still got 697 pets that I can't move over to the new game just yet, as well as 420 transferred pets that won't go ever at all. What should I do with them? Let me know in the comments. For the time this video goes out, tomorrow is the release of Pet Simulator 99, and I'm going to be streaming it. We've done everything in this game, and the only thing left to do is go to the new one. So I'll see you there, gamers. I just hope it's not going to be bad. Everybody's watching.